now. Josh. And there you have it. We are officially in the world of Silent Hill, which, as I understand it, serves as a sort of... No, let me not spoil it for anybody who doesn't know what Silent Hill is or seen this game for the first time, though. I doubt there's anybody seen this game for the first time. It's been out since 2008. Who'd park their truck here? Yeah, I'll just go ahead and say it. From what I understand, Silent Hill serves as a sort of... Um, I don't think anyone's in here. Uh, a purgatory or a limbo, right? It's a place that is meant for... Silent Hill, how the hell did I get here? I, I want to say, like, judgment? Like, the people who tend to end up here, it looks like the shop is closed, always seem to have, like, some kind of secret. They're either searching for somebody or they have a secret that needs to be exposed that they feel guilty about. And this town is, like, stuck in this, like, permanent limbo of ash from when it burned down because they were all into some, like, secret cult that was into, like, child sacrificing and... Because they tried to sacrifice uh, Anessa or Alyssa. I cannot remember her name from the first game. And she doesn't look like they're open anymore. Had a darkness inside of her. So instead of killing her, it set the darkness free, which set the town uh, basically on fire, permanently burning this, trapping everybody here in this purgatory state on top of unleashing monsters. So it's hell. I need to find a key to unlock this gate. Oh, I don't have it. Wait, do I have a key? No, right? No, I definitely don't. I have a watch. I have a watch. I got a watch. I don't have an axe either. Why would Joshua be hiding in a hotel? I need to make sure he's okay. I'll need something to break down these boards. I love that his first question is, how did I get here? But not, how the hell did Josh get here? Main interest. But see, that's the thing that's confusing. Doesn't look like they're open anymore. Because we start off in Shepherd's Glen and, oh, man... Shepherd's Glen looked a whole lot like Silent Hill in terms of the ash that's permanently falling down on it. And nobody's reacting to their environment in Shepherd's Glen, just like nobody ever reacts to the permanent state of Silent Hill because they're they're used to this world. So then you get confused, like, okay, am I in Silent Hill or am I in Shepherd's Glen? Are are they connected? How are they connected? Why is Shepherd's Glen burning just like Silent Hill is burning? Does Josh or not Josh, but uh Alex, is he the only one to notice? That the town is covered in ash? Or do they also notice that the town is covered in ash? Alright, we let him far enough away. We should be able to go down there now. Yeah, everything else is locked. Let's go. Let's make our great escape. And we're gone. I don't think he can jump down, so I think we're safe down here. Feeling pretty safe down here. Oh, there we go. That's what we needed. Beautiful. Looks like somebody already started using it before me. Actually, you look a lot like the dude that was eaten by the dog. Like, exactly like the dude that was eaten by the dog. All right, all right, all right, all right. So the axe, I'm not sure if that's going to be better than the knife because it's also bladed, right? So you imagine its attack power is pretty strong, but at the same time, it's got longer reach like the pipe. But that, of course, also means it's going to be slower, so I don't know if it's worth it. But we're going to switch to it real quick because we're going to need it to break down these hotel doors. Coming to save you. Don't worry about how creepy I look doing this. Yeah, here I come. Coming to set you free, Joshua. Here's Alex. Oh, he ran. I don't know why. I seem so friendly. Hello? Why can't I go through this door? Did I just break down this for nothing? There we go. I was like, what? what? That makes no sense. Why wouldn't I be able to go in the door? Hey, Joshua. Are you going to stay one place from me, bud? Or are you going to take off? I feel like you're going to take off. Josh? Yeah, you're going to take off. Okay. I do, even though this game, you know, looks super old and dated, looks like the lock is broken, I can't open it, I still love the environment, man. Like, this hotel looks great. I remember just so clearly what it was like to play these games the first time on an Xbox 360 and how, how great at the time it looked to me. I mean, not great like, wow, this looks so real, but just great like, man, this is a really fun environment to play in. One of the reasons I love horror games is that I feel like that they're they're so creatively free in these worlds that they can build. They're not constrained by logic. So they make it makes them a lot of fun to play, even if terrifying. 
Uh, Paul, as Mayor Bartlett will be working in the atrium late this evening, please make sure the exterior service doors are left unlocked. Mr. Jones. See, Mayor Bartlett is the mayor of Shepherd's Glen. What the hell is he doing being the mayor of Silent Hill? I got the Grand Hotel map. Okay, well, I love this. I love that we can see what we've used. I mean, what we've uh, tried to enter and is no longer accessible or was never accessible. That's super helpful when you can actually see it. Oh, Joshua, how difficult you seem to be. Wait, can we go through here? Nope, doors are jammed. We already read that. That's about Mr. Bay, or Mayor Bartlett. Again, I kind of want to put the knife back on, man. I don't feel like this is going to be great for me. I wonder who this elderly man is. Oh, probably one of the council members that burnt what's-her-name. I really should look that name up so I know who I'm talking about. Another council member. And another uh, actually looks like the same council member. All right, guess we're going this way. Let me see. Let me see what this is like. Oh, no, that's way too so. Yeah, we won't be using this as a weapon. No way. Not happening. We got over here. It's a box of tools. It looks pretty unorganized. I got a maintenance key. Dope. Is that to go down here or what? Maintenance key. Was there a maintenance door? Oh, what's that sound? What? 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 I don't like that. Not a fan of that. Oh, it's you. Okay. Well, no matter what, I'm not fighting you, so that, that doesn't really matter to me. Uh, what we need to do, though, switch out to a better weapon and then find out where in the world is Waldo. Maintenance key. This is all locked. But there is something... I'm faced the wrong way. There is something... Oh, on the back side? Of the elevator? Is that what it was saying? Oh, yeah, it totally was. Okay. Complete. That's why the map is so useful. It's jammed shut. That's okay. I got a key. Right? No? Bruh. All right. So, no. Um. One, two, three, four, and I'm gone. Uh, let's get a little bit further, actually. I feel like when he gets closer to you, he has like a little burst of speed that I want no part of. Yeah, you can kind of hear it there in the background. It sounds like he's moving pretty fast, right? Oh, no. He was just spitting all his puke out. That's what that is. All right. We got a maintenance key. I'm assuming we need to leave because all those doors in there were locked. And the fact that there was somebody behind us tells me that they wanted us to go backwards. We have something across the... Not even across the street, just outside the street and to the right. Hmm. Okay. No dogs, no dogs, no dogs, no dogs. All right, let's use inventory so we don't die. Please move. Please move faster. Move a lot faster. Oh, I see what's going to happen. We're going to get screwed. What is this? Need to rewire this. Please don't attack us while I'm rewiring this. Does it sound like they're still moving? It does, doesn't it? I'm going to see. I think we're going to get attacked, though. Oh, yeah. We are. We are. We definitely are. Okay. Got it. So we cannot... We can't do this puzzle while they're alive. They have to die. It was a waste of health, but I needed to test that theory. So the game doesn't technically pause, which means I need to find a way to attack these guys without dying. And they move when they're puking. How to do this? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, wait, who's what? How in the hell did they get me over there? I just died. Are you kidding me? That felt a little weird. That was a bit wonky. I, I, I didn't like that. And I'm also realizing I have not been using the dodge effectively, so that maybe that's also a problem. Stop standing in front of him and hitting him and expecting him not to hit me back. All right, here we go. Whoa, 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 whoa. See, look, I'm all the way over there, and I'm still getting hit by that stuff. That makes no sense to me. All right, let's see if this works a little bit better. And stopping him from attacking me. Oh, help. Ah, not as well as it does on the dogs, but it is better than the pipe. I'm getting a lot more hits in. It's not taking me as long to... I should probably move, but again, that range is so wide. It's like, does it even matter if I move? Okay, well, he's dead. So knife again. Use the freaking knife, dude. It is just OP. All right, let's get the axe, and I'll get back to where I was when I died. 
Don't let him do that. This one seems to be a little bit stronger. Maybe I should have just let, led him another way or something. Jesus, dude. We wasted way too much health on that one guy. He's going to be a pain. Clearly. Man, that is just... No bueno. All right, whatever. So there's some health back here. So at least we can replenish that. Oh, dude. All right, let's do this puzzle. Need to rewire this. Right. Rewire, rewire, rewire. What is... I right, turn that off, huh? Yeah. It's already off. Let me rewire this. Like, I need another wire? Am I missing a wire? I can't move anything. Because I'm clicking the wrong thing. Uh, connect. Connect. Oh, okay. There we go. Okay, that was. What? Wait, wait, wait. What? What is going on here? Don't. Ah. We... Uh, I'm so lost on what I'm clicking. Sometimes there's. What? What? What is it you're looking for me? Yeah, sometimes your your uh, your choice in clicking is not necessarily represented very well, and thus the problem I'm facing right now of trying to figure out where I'm clicking. Or maybe I was clicking the wrong thing. Maybe I don't need to click anything up here. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, I'm confused. That's two. So if that's two, then red and white must be correct, right? Leaving me with who to figure out? Nope, that didn't do it. That didn't do it either. I put us back at one. This is so confusing because that it, what I thought was a process of elimination isn't a process of elimination because red and white haven't changed and yet we're back to one when we had two. Hmm. Oh, wait, no, I can move all of them. Okay, before it seemed like I wasn't getting the option to move any of them because they weren't highlighting. Now they're getting highlighted. What? Dude, this game is just buggy. It's just a buggy game, dude. It's just so buggy. Okay, well, let's figure out what it is that they need to correspond to now. Now that we know that we can actually move more than just the green. There's got to be a schematic or something I'm supposed to look at. Really? There's no schematic, huh? Just guessing. Oh, wait. Here we go. Here's something. Don't forget to tape the big game XXI. What? Don't forget to tape the big game XXI. I think the XXI may be... The, the corresponding cable show, showing us where they're supposed to fit. That's the only thing I can think of, because why else would you leave that note right there? XXI. So if that's the case, and this is XXI, then this is already in the right spot. This is not. You. Yes, you. We need to go here. And then you would do the same thing where you would switch to here and you would switch to here and then I would be straight. That should be. Okay, we were just missing a note. Okay, so again, it is simple. I just had not explored as thoroughly as I should have. I ran too quickly to the puzzle thinking that I was smart enough to figure it out when I clearly was not and I paid the price for it. That's all right. Puzzle done. Back in hotel we go. 
Hey, boy. Uh-oh. Oh, we were doing so well. Wait for it. Does it pull through? Yes, it does. All right. We're gonna finish the game. Oh, boy. That was rough. That was rough. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to play the waiting game. Come on. I should lead him away from the elevator, huh? Okay, and we're gone. We're gone, we're gone, we're gone. Last time we were in an elevator, it worked out so well for us, too. Pistol ammunition, that's awesome. Press the button. I don't have much of a choice. Only one of the buttons seems to be functional. That's fine. Press that button. Just get moving. Man, why does this game run so rough, man? Okay, that was also bad. Whoa, oh, 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 oh. Okay, do something, fight him. Yes, fight him. You know what, why am I using this? I knew better than this. You you know we don't use any weapon that isn't the knife, the OP knife. Oh, I see why we don't. Okay, wait, I can do a strong attack. Get him off of there. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Come on, come through. Let him break through. Get in there, get closer. What are you doing? Get in there. Start stabbing. Please start stabbing before we get jacked up. Okay, there we go. Woo! Our aim was not great. But we had we hit a lot of greats, though. I also don't like that I have to press a button to ready up. Like, I can't already be ready. I have to shift and then start attacking. Because I missed a lot of attacks this way. Okay. He's gone. Oh, Jesus. There we go. Get off of my freaking ride. It's a one-seater, and you are way past the weight capacity. Here we go. In there. Out there. Get off my ride. Only need one. Who else is back? Who else wants some? Can I leave? I can't leave. Okay, we're not at our destination. Oh, crap. Of course we're going back down, because he cut something up top, right? I'm up. That doesn't seem safe. That doesn't seem safe at all. What floor do we get stuck on? Could you climb up and stop? Okay, get get off of that. Climb up. Or this thing comes crashing down on us like that. Oh, pretty lighty. I think she heard me. All right, lock is broken. Fair enough. Well, I'm just going to guess that she has a baby in there, because that's definitely go to sleep. I think there's something behind this painting. Do we look in the hole first? Hole's too small to fit through. Not for Joshua. Only a kid could fit through there. All right, lock is broken. No health. All right, let's start cutting. That seems similar to something we cut earlier before in the game. Oh, yes. Sweet reprieve. Joey Bartlett sitting in the treehouse in our backyard. Joey Bartlett. Well, that must be the mayor's kid then, which explains the coffin size or the kid size coffin. <laughs> the coffin size kid. Um, inventory for what the door is locked and won't open i need to find the key that's all right i'm not looking for the key right now i'm looking for this beautiful gorgeous red dot with three circles that you never actually find out what it means or maybe it's already been explained and i just never looked it up okay we're back at it let's do this let's figure out who we need to find in this oh josh right it's all about finding josh there's nobody else we need to find in this hotel just josh it looks like the locks but i can need to turn that off Josh, are you in there? No one comes to visit anymore. Doesn't sound like Josh. Who are you? I wish I could remember. What are you doing in this hotel? This place should be condemned. I can't leave. Not yet. This is no place to be alone. You need to leave. I lost something. Once dear to me. 
Now all I have is memories of the past, of better times, but I don't know where they are. I can't go until I have them. Will you help me? Tell me what you need. I'll see what I can do. So difficult to remember. The warm sunlight dancing on the water. The smell of cotton candy in the air. And the sound of wind blowing through the trees. Find them for me. And I'll give you what you need. How will I know when I found them? Three small windows of better days. You'll know when you see them. Okay, I'll look around. You have a kind voice. <laughs> so did she until that laugh came out. All right, uh, I'm not even going to play dumb. I'm pretty sure we need to find three photos. I'm almost positive that's what three small windows would be, because what else would it be, right? Oh, well, before we go in there... Okay, it doesn't matter. Either way, we're going to one of these doors. I like how he tells her that she shouldn't be in this condemned hotel. It's obviously a bad place to be alone, and yet he doesn't acknowledge, again, the mist, the monsters. There's no good place anywhere in any town right now. Sam, I can't thank you enough for all your hard work in restoring the atrium to its former glory. My illness continues to worsen, but it gives me great comfort that my Carol and I can find solace in the beautiful garden you've created. Thank you so much, Clayton. Only Clayton I know is from Tarzan, and pretty sure he's dead. All right, well, we don't need to read that again. What else do we have here? Nothing here, nothing here. So just a note about a beautiful garden. Don't know what that noise was. There's nothing else in here, right? I'm not crazy. Just this. All right, yeah, let's get up at... Oh, yeah, I'm just paranoid. There's nothing here. The other side. This one's a little bit more, uh... A little bit more decrepit. I got beetles and everything walking around. It looks like the lock is broken. Can't open it. Can't do anything there. Nothing to see here. You got a note on the wall. The message here says, I can't see my face. Maybe you will in 404. I don't know what that means. I don't think we want to know what that means. A face separated from the body seems like a problem. I feel like we can probably crawl through there, or at least Josh could. We'll take this way first, though. The hell is is that? What is that sound? Yeah, I figured out the reason that the audio sounded so low was because it only, it only, whatever that is, um, it's only coming through one one channel. So I got to have both headphones on real tight. I actually just need to have the right headphone on so that I can hear it a lot more uh, here. Don't know why I just got stuck there. Anything, anything. Who left it this way? Gross. Like you said, man, it's an abandoned building. I don't think anybody was coming up here to maintain or clean. Okay, so far so good. I haven't ran into anything that would kill us. Heard some things in the distance that sounded like... They may kill us. Or try to. Locked, locked, locked. Maybe I should have saved before uh, going any further. Just in case. Dearest Sam, I can't describe how much my life has turned a corner since you've begun tending the atrium. With Clayton's illness slowly taking its toll, I've felt so lost and alone. Your presence and your gift in restoring the garden... Your presence and your gift in restoring the garden, it's the single ray of light in my tired life, and it brings me joy. Thank you for the many wonderful evenings we spent together. It will be different, better, when I no longer have to pretend all my love, Carol. Oh, Clayton. You may want to... Well, I mean, at this point, it sounds like he doesn't have much longer anyway, so I just keep with the status quo, dude. At least she's taking care of you. Uh, she may be moving on a little bit earlier than he would like, but um, it says 405 scares me. I left my ducky in there. I don't... Apparently, I don't want to go to the fourth floor at all. Somebody's missing a face up there, and somebody's scaring somebody else. Somebody young, presumably, because they had left a ducky in there. I don't know too many adults that refer to toys as duckies. Or that just have ducks as anything of importance to them that aren't alive. Yeah, I don't... 
have an axe yet, so something tells me I'm not gonna be able to get in there. Oh wait, do I have an axe? Am I crazy? Do I have an axe? I do have an axe. What am I talking about? Of course I have an axe. So I got in here in the first place. Glad I didn't just run off and miss this. What, what are you looking up at? What? 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 It looks like just a hole. Uh, okay, it's like a back way to get in. Okay. Can't unlock doors. Doors, once they're broken, they're just broken. All right, well, we have this as a way to go upstairs. Is there anything on this side? Nope. Can't jump down. Can't get over. All right, guess we're going up. One, uh, I think I can climb on this rubble. It seems stable enough to climb, my friend. No reason to climb down. There's a door on this side, but maybe we should check this room for... Man, this place makes a lot of noise. Carol, I'm struggling to find the right words. My body was broken, and now you've broken my heart, too. I don't know why. I loved you unconditionally, gave you everything I had. I thought you loved me, too. I guess I was a fool. There are things, things about Sam you don't know, and if you did, I guarantee you'd feel differently. I want to forgive you, Carol, but I can't. I've simply nothing left. That doesn't sound good for Clayton or Sam, or, um, Carolyn. Sounds like she may have gone with somebody pretty by it. Oh, what does that sound? What does that sound? What does that sound? What does that sound? What is that? Ah, shoot. How do I fight? Right. Found it. Found it. I think. Am I hitting them? I can't tell. Oh, yeah. I am. I am. I am. I am. I am. I am. No, hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Okay. Oh, it's one of those, uh, one of those frozen bugs. Okay, that's cool, too. Can we, can we unfreeze it? I probably shouldn't even mess with it just in case I bug something out. Right, we'll just let it, we'll just let it sit there in the air. Locked. I'm guessing locked as well, right? Why do I hear more of those things? Why do I hear more of those things? What? 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 Where? 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 Still there, huh? All right, cool. Just leave that as a gift in here, then. Nothing on this side. I don't even want this weapon, though. That's the crazy part. I want the knife because it's quicker. I hear a lot of those things. Delivery notice. Akamil Hospital Toll. Two oxygen oxygen tanks removed and replaced with full ones for Miss Doyle's suite. Hmm. Is Miss Doyle the one sending the bugs out to meet us? Oh, that's our radio. Okay, I'm like, what is that? St oh, oh. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, this ain't the weapon I want. This ain't the weapon I want. I want this one. Get in your combat stats, my friend. Here we go. Going in. There we go. Come on. There you go. Come on. There you go. Come on. Yeah. She can't get in. She can't get in. She can't get in. Stick with it. Stick with it. Come on. There we go. There we go. Ooh. The nurses seem pretty easy to take down as long as you get that knife. And don't let up on the attack, even when it seems like you're going to lose. All right. We can, we can relax. And you can start running again. Ah, that sounds bad. That sounds real, real bad. Wait, does this move? I'm not about to walk up on somebody, am I? Everything cool? Oh, yes, to the bullets. The memories that she's looking to reclaim. That is not a bullet. That is a photo. This must be. Yep. I long for the days before my illness overtook me. From my window, I can see a large oak. The leaves are ablaze, yellow and red, and with each day, more of them fall. When the sun is low, the shadows from the branches trail across my walls, but soon after, the darkness fills the room. Please come and see me soon. I want to share one more memory with you while I still can. Love always. Huh. I wonder if that's Clayton's. All right. Well, no, it's a woman. It couldn't have been Clayton's unless he got a change recently. So I guess it could be, uh, what's her name? Gloria, Sam's, whatever. The one who cheated on or left, uh, Clayton in the first place for Sam. You still good out here? Yeah, still good. Still good. I think I checked this room. I can't remember anymore. Yeah, I did. Okay, moving on. Everything cool? Ooh. 
Yeah, everything is locked. Everything is staying closed. No more locked doors. What about the elevator? Does that work? At least let me call the elevator. This is an interesting scene. What? Focus on the wrong theme, man. That's a long drop down. Okay, can't go that way. All right, well, we got one memory at least, so maybe we're supposed to go back and drop the memory off. Maybe. I feel like you can get that. Oh, whoa, 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 oh, 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 wait, yeah, uh, attack mode, attack mode, come on, come on, come on, attack him in the air, let him freeze, oh, yeah, okay. Oh, we can build, like, a cool sculpture with these things. Look at this one, man, it's, uh, it's already got a very, it's a, um, it's a abstract pose, it, it's symbolizing the way the world works and how it's many facets of legs, that, I, I don't know what the hell I'm saying, it looks cool. Um, but I'm pretty sure one of the games, you can get that guy's sword, right, Pyramid Head sword, I feel like you can use it against him. I think it's Silent Hill 2 when Pyramid Head makes his first appearance. All right. Uh, don't know what caused this door to bust open, but at least it gave us a way forward. Probably shouldn't turn my back to that area. Toilet smells like what? This toilet smells like poison. Well, we're looking at the sink, my man, so I don't know. It's not a toilet. Yeah, easily one of the coolest characters ever created for Silent Hill. Even though he was only supposed to be in Silent Hill 2, I think he was... Dude, just too grave an idea to let go. Just too cool of a character design. And then I, I even liked in the Silent Hill movie where they uh, kind of made him and not an anti-hero, but he, he saved old girl uh, Alessa. Kind of acted as her uh, guardian. Or was that Silent Hill 2? I think, I think that was Silent Hill 2 that he acted as her guardian and showed up to fight that, that one woman. I thought that was pretty cool. Really cool scene. Really showed off the uh, badassery of the dude with the blade. Nope, 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 and nope. Uh, I wish there was a quick select for my weapon. Ah, there is. There we go. Here we go. Nope. Don't need that. Need this. Perfect. Why right, taking any better when we can do leg day? Ooh, not that leg day. Wrong leg day. Go up. Go up. 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 Josh, wait. You gotta be shitting me. Okay, best weapon. I'm not really sure. We're gonna try the combat now. Ah, we're about to eat it. 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 Um, how do I do this? How do I do this? Go back. Okay. Hey, okay, nice, nice, nice. Get into attack mode. What are you doing, my man? I did not have not saved in a while. So go into attack mode, my man. 
What are you doing here? Come on. Is he blocking these? Ah! Wait, hold on. Roll. Ah! Hey, okay, gotta keep it moving. Keep it moving. Keep it moving. Come on. Roll with it or something. Come on, roll, roll, roll right, roll right. I can't even tell if we're doing damage right now. Okay, wait a minute. Hold on. Strong attack and dead. All right, so I... Oof. I'm definitely going to have to figure out a better strategy for this, that one because that did not work well. Could be because I was using the short knife too. Maybe I should have brought out the axe, but, you know, I just feel like that knife is just so much more effective than anything else we have. But maybe I'm just not using... The hell was that sound? Oh, it was just the chair. Not using the axe properly. I hear static. Oh, ha! Ah! Die. Die. Swing. 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 Ah! Come on. Get off. Get off. Get off. Get off. Get off. Get off. I just heard something cry out. Sound like a young boy. All right, what do we got here? Nope, nope. Let go, let go, let go. Calm down, calm down. There's a little bit of a delay between ready up and unready, and I keep pressing it, thinking it's not reading me. Jim, they were there again last. They were there again last night. I saw Carol creeping towards the main ballroom, and you know where that leads. I don't know what the old man would do if he were to find out. Given his health, he might not make it. Do you think I should say something? Carol, Carol was her name. Okay, so that's clearly Paul seeing Carol creeping out on. Clayton. Yeah, he, he finds out. It doesn't seem like it goes well either. Alright, well, we can leave here now. Got a little bit more authority to us now. He's just slamming through doors. Uh, I guess we can start here and go behind us now. Coming through. Nope, not that one. There we go. Is it daylight outside? What is this? Why is it so bright right here? Just to show us that we can go through? Or no, that can't be the reason. Like something needs to reflect off of there or something. I'll tell you what, if Josh is surviving all of this, he either cannot see these monsters or is the most self-sufficient little kid 10 year old ever alive mr jones i saw something strange the other night and i wanted to bring it to your attention i'd unlock the service doors to the atrium to let Mi uh to let mayor bartlett in just like i usually do i came by later to see if he needed any help you know how i like to grow things too and i saw him dragging one of his bags of fertilizer inside only it didn't look like any kind of fertilizer bag i've ever used it was real heavy and he seemed to be kind of struggling with it he didn't see me, so I crept away. Should I tell the sheriff? I don't know what to do, but I thought you should know. Paul Ashley. Bond your mother-loving business. This postcard could be one of her memories. There's a message on the back. What a wonderful day. The smell of cotton candy and the sound of laughter filled the air. That evil thing. Days like this make me appreciate what it was like to be young and carefree. Family is the most important thing, and our children are the future. I only wish I could feel that innocent again. See you soon. Is that my light? Okay, that is my light. I was like, what the hell is moving in the background? All right, that's that. Grab the health drink. Boom, boom, boom. I wonder if she's got like Alzheimer's. Maybe that's why. Because I feel like this has got to be Carolyn, right? That we're bringing the memories back to. I mean, I don't know what happened to her. Oh, ah. Okay, we'll try this one. We'll see if this works for us. Ready up, ready up, ready up. Oh boy. There you go. Okay, here we go. What the hell is going on? Ah. Okay, it's not working. It's not working, y'all. It's not working. Okay, I'm dying. 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 Okay, what the heck? Come on, man. Please keep moving. Here we go. Here we go. Whew. I don't even know how we're doing those. Oh, man. 
Roll up out of that. Keep it moving. Wait, what's that sound? What, 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 what? That's one. That's two. And an odd third one. Nothing, nothing. You ain't saying what else? Uh, shotguns? Can't carry anymore. Can't carry anymore. What is that? Bullets? You can't carry anymore. There's always what? Three handgun. Ah, uh, let's see if I can reload real quick. Five. Let's see here. Reload. I don't know if this counts. There we go. Cool. 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 Reload some more. Nope. You can only have five. I guess in a mag. So we'll go back to this. Say, wait, so I can only have 10 rounds? And this is hardcore and I can have a max of 10 rounds? How does this work? Like, I feel like I, even with 10 rounds, I couldn't kill like a basic enemy. What am I supposed to kill with this in 10 rounds? That's a weird sound. Give me my knife back. The smell. I can't breathe in here. That's another way to go back downstairs, but we don't want to do that just yet. So we'll come here, go out, see if we miss anything further down the hall. Right? Because I'm not turned around, am I? Yeah, we we have not explored this way yet. Okay. Who? I hear demons, but I don't see demons. Oh, that'll probably lead to the staircase, so nothing there. Guess we're going downstairs again. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, wrong one, wrong one. Okay, roll out, roll out, roll out, roll out. Roll, ah, dude, I said roll out. What are you doing? Get down, get down, get down, get down. Okay, no reason to fight it. We'll come back for that if we have to, which I'm pretty sure we'll have to. Get down, get down, get down. Hmm. Man. All right, we're good. One more. It's a postcard. There's a message on the back. I have some sad news to share. Yesterday, I took a boat out as far as I could row, and I dipped my face into the cold, clear water. As I leaned over the side of the rowboat, my necklace caught on the oar, and the chain snapped. I saw your precious gift slip into the blackness. I wanted to dive in after it, but the water was so icy, so deep. Please forgive me. I miss you. I think I found all the memories that woman is looking for. I should give them back to her. I found all the memories that woman is looking for. I should give them back to her. You can't wash it off. I wonder if they're referring to her sins or what she perceives as her sins is like turning her back on her husband. Then again, we don't know the relationship. Maybe he was abusive. Maybe he was an asshole. We're going to have to go back upstairs and try not to die. All right. We deserve this fight. Turn this off. Here we go. And go. Can I? Can I? Oh, go, 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 go. Wait, which way do we come from? Which way do we come from, y'all? Which way? Stairs, right? Stairs? All right. We're gone. We're gone. We're good. We're good. We're gone. And across. I don't think he can follow us. Hmm. Yeah, it's more trouble. Go through here. Oh, nope. Nope, don't want no part of it. Not trying to fight y'all. Just trying to live. Let me live. Where do we go from here? I'm going to get trapped. Uh. Oh, it's literally across from us. I just chose the wrong room. Right? Yeah, here we go. That's the room we needed. Okay. So far. What the hell is that sound? Oh, no, not you. Okay. Run. Go in. Go through. Perfect. Wait a minute. Why can't I see? It'd be good the rest of the way back, right? Because this door is where she's at. You may take your items. Is this what you wanted? Thank you. I got a strange key. She gone? Yeah, the only memories I can think that that would be would be uh uh Carolyn's. That has to be Carolyn's memories that we just gave back to her. She gave us a strange key. I'm trying to remember where we. 
where we need to take this key. Use the key I got from the lady in room 301. Room 30. Ah, here we go. Room 306 has a unique like file. Blah, blah, unique lock. Find a way to open it. 306. Of course, that's on this floor, but where? 307. 307. 306. 4. Am I blind? Where's 6 at? Maybe it's over here. Maybe this is the room they're talking about. Oh, right, 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 right. I think that is definitely the room they're talking about. This room, right? Let's see here. Inventory. That's not inventory. Is this inventory? Ah, here we go. Also, what is this watch again for? That item cannot be used here. Can I examine it? Can't even examine it. Just, it's a thing. Hey! What's up, little bro? That's an easy jump. That's not even a crazy... You definitely got... Uh, we're not going to make it, are we? The fact that they're giving us this option tells me we're not going to make it. All right, here we go. I'm going to try. Josh! Please help me. Josh! Don't let me fall! Josh. Where the hell did I just drop to?